Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, I'm sorry I haven't made a much videos the last couple of days. Uh, a lot of things have, uh, I guess, have taken up my time. But um, yeah, I'm back. This is I'm still here. There's another to uh, this to the video of today is kind of like a tip and a hidden feature of Windows that. I think will help you guys out and uh, it certainly saves a lot of time for me as well so I'm going to show you guys how um, uh, what it is it's basically it's you can call it how the master control panel of windows um, generally when we want to go to control panel we'll go to start go to control panel and then um, uh, of course yours will look like this most likely it will look like this this is a generalized um, control panel settings you have system security network internet hardware and sound programs user accounts etc right those are the headings and then under that you have your subheading uh, settings you can use right view devices and printers add a device install uninstall a program um, so yeah these are the basic settings to make this more specified then you go to you want to click here view by uh, click this and then click small icons or you can have large icons uh, but small icons if you guys remember Windows XP this is basically how the Windows XP control panels uh, layout look like um, you have more options available for your control panel so you'll um, now you have like specified options like mouse and keyboard and uh, you know uh, action center you have all these different settings here uh, programs and um, programs and features like that you have more uh, settings here but at the same time this is also kind of generalized what I mean by that is let's say I want to change okay for example let's say I want to change my computer um, when my computer will go to sleep uh, like if right now if my computer goes to sleep 10 minutes it, for 10 minutes if I don't use my computer my t computer goes to sleep I don't want that I want my computer to go to sleep two hours if, if, my, if I'm not using my computer for two hours then I want it to go to sleep for example right? so to change that I will go to power options then uh, you can click um, here change when the computer sleeps right then from here then I can go ahead and you know change change it to whatever uh, turn off the display in 10 minutes put the computer to sleep in two hours right so that's how I would go about doing that right but the problem with that is it you kind of you have to go through a lot of clicks to get to there. Uh, you'll have to click start, then go to control panel, then power options, then uh, change when the computer sleeps, and then you can go ahead and change whatever you want. With with what I'm going to show you, the um, master control panel, it saves you a ton of time to search for exactly what you want and change the setting immediately. So it's a much easier way of doing doing things. Um, so let's get started. How you what you will need is uh, basically there's this code, right? It's not a code. It's just um, I guess a, sc a script or a line uh, that that enables you to make the master control panel. Uh, I have it here. I'm gonna copy this and put it in the description of the video, so you guys can copy and paste it as well. Uh, what you wanna make sure is you wanna make sure you highlight uh, everything from the start to the the beginning, uh, from from the start to the end. I mean, right? You wanna make sure you copy this entire thing. Don't even miss like a period or um, a bracket. Make sure you have everything. You highlight the entire this entire code from the capital M at the beginning to the curly braces closed curly braces at the end, right? You wanna highlight everything. 
don't worry I'll, I'll paste this in the description so you guys won't have to like squint and read this from the, from the video <laughs> right so highlight it then right click and copy and then what you want to do is go to your desktop or wherever you want to make this file um, just uh, I'm gonna make in the desktop desktop to show you guys right now but you can make it wherever uh, right click then you go to new and then go to folder new folder then um, uh, within this folder name you want to right click and then click paste okay and uh, that pastes the code we just copied it pastes that entire thing right here right it pastes that entire code um, you want to make sure you have the exactly the code that that was there before you copy the entire thing and then just click outside once you do that you'll notice that the icon changes and this is the control panel icon now and it's called master control panel with this I'll, I'll go ahead and double click it right now and then you'll see with this you have this is basically like every uh, control panel setting you could have that Windows 7 offers um, all all of it under inside one nice nice little window for you guys to use right? so now within this you have every single setting you need you see like uh, you know whatever whatever setting you might want check security status uh, schedule task um, but what I was like what I was showing you before what you what would you what you would do was go to start and control panel then um, power options and then change when the computer sleeps and then you can change it now with the master control panel you just double click it then I can go down to uh, you know the power options and you'll see right here change when the computer sleeps so that saves me a ton of time I just have to double click that and I'm directly into that window um, I want it I want to I want to be in so it saves me a t time searching for this I can just come directly to my master control panel and I'm here if you don't want to scroll through like you know everything here you can just click here this search bar up here and then uh, type in what your a keyword that you're looking for maybe I'm looking for uh, sleep and then it comes down here change when the computer sleeps require a password when the computer wakes right? so um, yeah you can just search for whatever you want uh, you won't have to scroll through every single option that's here so um, yeah this is basically the Windows 7 master control panel it's a hidden feature you guys you know none of nobody would know about it unless they actually uh, make a folder with this with this code as its title so um, yeah uh, I hope this tip will help you guys out uh, I know it really it, it helps me a lot uh, it helps me out a lot as well so you just you can make it up make it keep it in your desktop somewhere or keep it in whatever folder you want to use you just open it up and edit go to whatever setting you want right so um, thanks a lot guys for watching don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And also, please, if you have any uh, suggestions for future videos, don't hesitate to send me a message or just leave a comment uh, in this video below. And I'll and I and I'll certainly try my best to make a video on that. Thanks a lot, guys. Take care.